Hello, everyone. My name is Yesenia Sanderson. I'm with the University of Arkansas. Um, okay, so last week, the university welcomed more than 27,000 students to campus. Um, our freshman class, um, over 25% of our students are in the top 10% of their high school classes, and more than half of them are in the top 25%. Um, this year's class is entering with an average school GPA of a 3.69 and an average ACT of a 26. Um, our campus continues to grow, but this is not at um, the cost of quality. The student to faculty ratio is um, 19 to one. Um, the University of Arkansas is a great place to study. Um, it's also a great place to live. Fayetteville was uh, recently named one of the top best places to live um, by, uh, in America by US News and World Report. Um, Fayetteville has a lot to offer students in the community um, as well as recreational opportunities. Um, we are excited to announce the university has just established, established a school of art. Um, thanks to a $120 million gift from the Walton Family Charitable Support Foundation. Um, also, as you work with your students, please remember our scholarship deadline. Um, in order to meet the November 15th deadline, um, students will need to apply um, to, for admissions and submit transcripts, transcripts and ACT scores um, by November 1st. Um, this is our priority admissions deadline. Um, also, please tell your students about our upcoming campus preview day, which is Razorback Reveal. It's just around the corner, October 7th. Um, and I do want to mention the NRTA um, Scholarship Board. Um, for bordering states, students who apply for admissions um, will automatically be considered uh, for a 90% award um, that'll waive the difference between in-state and out-of-state tuition. And for the extended states, um, students are considered automatically for awards that waive up to 80% of the difference between in-state and out-of-state tuition. Um, I look forward to talking to you during the information exchange. Thank you.